Thank you. Good morning. Welcome to New York and the third annual meeting of the CGI. I believe the fact that a real difference has been made by the people in this room and lives all across the globe shows how much more we have to do and indicates our obligation to increase our efforts. The premise of CGI is that we are faced with complex problems that government either is not solving or that government alone cannot solve. But what has brought us together and what connects us, as nearly as I can determine, are three basic convictions. First is, just about everybody in this room believes that our common humanity is more important than our interesting differences. I s believe this simple issue is at the root of most of the world's conflicts. In almost every corner of the world where people are fighting instead of working together, they have reached the decision that our differences are more important than our common humanity. The second thing that brings us together is we seem to all accept our shared responsibility for correcting as much as we can the current challenges of the world and passing along a better world to our children. The third is we actually believe we can do it. We believe we can make a difference. It is incumbent on us to say, no, please, for goodness sake, listen to the calls of the people. The people are saying, we just want freedom and democracy. Please, please. I think it's the misuse of religion for political purposes that's causing the problem. I think it's the, 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 the politicization of religion that causes the problems. Peace doesn't come from the barrel of a gun. That's what we found. We have to have, we have to give a person human dignity, food on the table, and a job, and we have to invest in people. What we realized as a company is that if we're going to resolve the problems that you talk about in this forum, that it's going to take all of us. You cannot wait for government. Business already has a bias for action. Business has the ability to allocate capital, both human capital and financial capital, to address issues. Business has the opportunity to create innovation that will, in fact, resolve many of the problems that we talk about when it comes to climate change. I think it's going to be a responsibility of the developed world to reassure the developing world that this doesn't come at their expense, but instead can be of support and help for their aims of overcoming poverty. I wanted to say why I think the effort to solve the climate crisis is actually the key to giving us the ability to successfully address these other crises, whether it's religious strife or the effort against global poverty or, or HIV AIDS or, or the others. When people from different points of view with different experiences have a shared goal that is urgent that's connected to their survival, they find the ability to put their differences aside and work together.